Hello, fellow YouTubers. This is Derek Duct Tape Man here. First, I'd say thank you for filming my channel and watching my videos. Today, I'm going to show you something with my um, duct tape chest set here. I'm going to show you a little bit of a move by move in a game of chess and opening what really goes on. And I'll show you some games, some people do. And I'll show you right now what some people do. And I'll show you right now. I just showed you from my chest set here something very interesting. If you, if you pay attention to it, you know, a player goes first, then the next player copies that first exact move. And he keeps on going on, 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 and on. You know, when I play chess and people do that to me, that is very annoying. And I don't really get annoyed that much, but that does annoy me. It's really annoying when they do that. When you play checkers, same way. So, it's very annoying. In fact, when there are um, other chess players playing chess too, get game, other games, they even copy your moves. I'm like, okay, I've never experienced that, but if I would, that would really be annoying. I mean, you're supposed to think, you're supposed to watch your own game. <laughs> you want to copy everything just because I somebody else do it? Okay. Now, if a chess player know, if you want to get, get a teacher lesson, give advice. You know, take his advice. He'll learn something. Learn his tactics, routines. That's different. That's not what I'm talking about. You no, know, when you're actually playing a game, everybody's doing exactly what you're doing just because you're doing it. Yeah, that could be annoying. Very annoying. But here's the thing. It's very interesting. Playing chess. Maybe that, that might work maybe the first three or four moves. Maybe maybe five, six, or maybe seven, eight at the most. But we go on move after move after move. And, and a lot of times what I do to break that, either A, I try to check the other person's king, or B... Put my queen in danger, and then there'll be um. Which I can, they take my queen. I can play without my queen. But even after that, they try to put, try to try to copy my moves, and that can be annoying. But the interesting thing is, the one that goes first in that situation wins like seventy-five percent of the time. Like twenty-four percent of it is a draw, and the one that actually copies, they um. They only win like maybe 91% of the time. So it doesn't even, it even work for you. So why would you even try it? When you know you're going to lose. So it is an easy win. So I shouldn't complain. But it's still annoying. That's the thing. Still annoying. But I've been thinking about that. You know, you see that a lot in school, especially school, but even adults too. You know, they, there's like a certain thing they have that they want, or there's a certain um, thing everybody's doing, you want to do it, or there's like a party because everyone else is going to be there, you want to be there, just because everyone else is doing it. Not only is that very silly, that's very sad too. Because whatever happened to one things because you like doing it. You know, if you want to be cool, okay. Do the things you like doing. You be you. Don't mind what everybody else thinks. That's going to make you a cool person. That will make you a cool person. And besides, 
a lot of stuff people are doing, going, getting. You know, just because other people are doing it, a lot of times either A, it's harmful to themselves, harmful to other people, or it's not the right thing to do at all. So either there, or either situation, it's probably not the right thing to do anyway. But just because... And why would you want to do it, knowing what it could do? So, how about doing things you like doing? Because I know, what if everybody decided to go jump off a high building or high cliff? Would you do it? Probably not. I'm pretty sure you wouldn't. So, why would you do other things that people, other people are doing? No, just because other people are doing it, other people have it, or other people are going does not mean you should do it, and very likely is an indication that you shouldn't be doing it. So I'm just here to remind you, like, school year, just because somebody else has something, or is doing something, or going somewhere, or doing something, maybe it, you doing it is not a good idea. Something to think about. So I can thank you for this, and thank you for watching. And this is Derek Duct Tape Man saying, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, share, like, notifications, and get more busy. This is Derek Duct Tape Man saying, see you later. Goodbye.